Safe when you got rappers getting shot at on IG Live. Snapdog. This Detroit rapper is known for getting up to some mischief on social media. Snapdog isn't exactly afraid to push some boundaries. Like in this video that went viral online when he rolls up in a car, pops out, screams bitch, and starts blasting. However, this wasn't a real shootout. In fact, the whole thing was part of a video shoot. The cops didn't like it though, and came to bust the whole thing up, arresting everyone involved. That one might not be real, but that doesn't mean Snapdog hasn't inadvertently recorded himself facing down some ops. Like the time Snap and his crew were live on IG, screaming into the camera and partaking in your typical internet hype session. Things got dire real quick when someone off camera can be heard asking, who's Snapdog, before bullets start flying. You know, I'm I'm snap. Do what's happening. Snapdog went viral after that, but even he had to admit things were getting a little out of hand. Honeycomb Brazy. This next rapper got into a shootout while buying a Kobe Bryant jersey outside a barber shop. These ops can find you anywhere. Honeycomb Brazy is a rapper from Mobile, Alabama. He better known for his activities in the street than his music. He started getting arrested at just 10 years old. He's been involved in a lot of gang violence, been stabbed over 10 times, and even though he's just in his late 20s, Brazy has spent over a decade behind bars. In November 2020, Brazy was sitting in a parked car with his homies on live when bullets start flying out of nowhere. Brazy ducks and the screen goes black. Surveillance footage shows exactly how the shootout went down. A gray BMW drives past Brazy and his crew. A few seconds later, gunshots start coming from off screen. Brazy and his crew start ducking and try to reach into the back seat to grab their guns. They managed to shoot their way out of the situation, and somehow, nobody in his crew got hurt. Indian Red Boy. This next rapper got shot and killed on IG Live while talking to his homie. According to some theories, it was all over some beef about disrespecting the late rapper Nipsey Hussle's mural in LA. Indian Red Boy was a rapper and gang member associated with the Inglewood family gangsta bloods. And despite the theories, Red Boy wasn't actually the one that defaced the mural. That would be his friend and fellow gang member Capone. In retaliation for some other beef, Capone defaced Nipsey's mural and spray painted his name all over it so everyone would know who did it. This wasn't going to go down without any retaliation. A longtime friend of Nipsey named Cowboy had to issue a warning. I I bet you gonna change your name today. I bet you that. Y'all need to. Y'all need to beat that right now before the homies mount up and and, and, and come do some dumb. Shit. Other members of the Inglewood family Gangsta Bloods, including Indian Red Boy, got involved to back up their homie Capone. Not long after, Indian Red Boy was sitting in a parked car in the Hawthorne neighborhood of Los Angeles, laughing with his friend Capone on IG Live. That's when he got shot. I'll spare you the gory visuals, but in the video you can hear multiple gunshots in the background. Red Boy gets fatally shot live and dies before anyone could come help him. You can see Hawthorne PD, uh, they are wrapping up their investigation here, still taking some photographs. We watched the coroner just a wheel the body away. It is a male in his 20s uh, that was shot and killed inside this car. There are a lot of bullet holes inside that windshield we zoomed in earlier.